What's going on everybody? All right, we got a 2007 Ford F-150. Uh, customer complaint was rear brakes were grinding. Um, had a look here. This side's not so bad. The other side is a little bit worse. A lot of rust has uh, kind of seized these pads into place here and it's worn all the way down on the inside grinding there. So we're gonna go ahead and show you how uh, to replace these brake pads and rotors here um, on these F-150s. All right guys, so we're gonna go ahead and get started here. Uh, first thing we're going to do is go ahead and get the top and bottom caliper bolts out here. Uh, they are a 10 millimeter, so we'll go ahead and use a wrench. Get those cracked free. Once I've got those loose a little bit like that, I'll go ahead and just take a screwdriver, stick it in that caliper, and push that piston in. This makes it a lot easier for trying to go back together. Go ahead and get your bolt out. That's the bottom one. We'll get the top one the rest of the way out here. All right, there we go. Set this one off to the side too. I'll go ahead and use a screwdriver or pry bar. Just pick up on the caliper here. Uh, just to get it out of the way. ton of rust on this guy here. So the same problem we're having on the other side. The pads, man, they're just pretty much seized into place here. Right. So we'll go ahead and uh, we'll get this caliper cleaned up here in just a second. We've already got the put piston pushed back in, so that's good there. Uh, let's just set it off to the side. Let's go ahead and get these pads out of here. All right, and then pretty much take the camera out. Uh, so you can see this, like I said, this is the problem we're having on both sides. This side just wore out a little bit faster. So we'll go ahead and take the uh, rotor off here now. So in order to do that, nothing fancy you'll need here other than just a hammer. Give it a few taps on the front side here. Once it comes free, we'll go ahead and knock it loose. All right, so a lot of times you'll see these get stuck on these uh, parking brake shoes here. Um, these are definitely rusted here. Uh, we're not going to be replacing these today, just the pads and the rotors. So let's go ahead and get this all cleaned up here and get ready to install our new rotor and uh, brake pads. All right, we're going to go and get our hardware off here of the... Uh, the knuckle. Excuse us. A screwdriver and you can tap up on it. And that'll pull it straight off. We'll do the same thing for the top, but we'll go down with it. Alright. Alright, go ahead and get your new hardware installed, cleaned up here. Alright, so we'll go ahead and get our new rotor here. Go ahead and slip it on. Once it's on, we'll go ahead and work on getting our pads installed here, getting the caliper cleaned up, and going back together. Yeah. 
Then we'll grab our outboard pad and we're gonna install it just like so. All right, once you've got it all locked into place here, um, you wanna make sure you grease all your contact points. Uh, make sure your guides are moving real, real easy, in and out, no problems there. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and slip this caliper back on. All right, once you've got everything seated into place, we'll go ahead and get our uh, two caliper bolts that we took off in the beginning here. Get those started back in. Go ahead and tighten these down. All right, just make sure that they're all tight. And then um, from there, you're finished up. That's it, thanks for watching.